My name is Stephen Raspa. I'm Associate Director of Community Events for Burning Man. And I wanted to welcome all of you personally to Desert Arts Preview. This is really one of my most uh, favorite events of the year because it's an opportunity for all of us to hear directly from the artists about their work. You're going to get a sneak peek behind the curtain and into the minds of these artists and creative teams as they talk about their projects that they're working on for Burning Man 2018. We will also this evening remember and celebrate our founder, Larry Harvey, who died on April 28th. Larry, we miss you, but you're in the theater with us tonight. And all of us that knew you and love you. Larry was passionate about encouraging authentic human expression, not just at Burning Man, but around the world. Besides writing the theme and designing the man base each year, Larry sat on the annual grants committee and worked directly with artists in our community for over 30 years. So this evening is also about what Larry loved, what he believed in, and Burning Man's continued work in the world. So it's especially fitting that at the midpoint of the program this evening, we pay tribute and celebrate Larry Harvey, and then we will have a 15 minute intermission. So it's going to be an amazing and heartfelt program this evening. At its core, this evening is about human expression and making imaginative and bold visions real together. We're committed to doing that with all of you because Burning Man has always been a collaborative and inclusive experiment in community. So thanks to each of you for being here today to support these artists, for being a part of our community and the work we do in the world. And thank you for joining Burning Man and seeking to make the world a more amazing, expressive, engaging, and wonderful world. Okay, are you excited for the program? Good. Me too. So I'm very pleased to introduce to you your MCs for the evening, uh, Katie Hazard and Jeremy Crandall, and they will be telling you about the Burning Man theme this year and about the artists that you'll be hearing from. Katie Hazard is the program manager of Burning Man Arts and the co-lead and of the art department. She manages the honoraria program and with her team is responsible for placing all the art on Playa. Her first year in Black Rock City was 2000 and she's been working for the art department since 2013. Jeremy Crandall is co-lead of the art department with Katie and has been involved with the art department since 2001. Jeremy supports fire art safety, art support services, and eyes on art teams and has personally worked on a number of large-scale art projects in Black Rock City and beyond. So please join me in welcoming Katie and Jeremy. Ladies and gentlemen, that's Katie Hazard. And ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeremy Crandall. <laughs> We are thrilled to be here together with all of you tonight to celebrate some of the amazing art coming to Black Rock City this year. Um, we have a great uh, program of performers tonight. We have, pre sorry, <laughs> presenters tonight. Um, a series of 15 artists will be sharing about their work with you. And then we have another whole collection of artists who are displaying in the gallery in the back that I hope you had a chance to check out. And we expect um, at least 300 art installations in Black Rock City this year, so you may notice, yeah. Um, at the end of your row, we have pictures taped of some projects that aren't able to be here in person tonight, so please check those out, too, when you're coming. Um, I wanted to take a quick chance to check in about this year's theme, which many of you know is iRobot. So that comes from a series of short science fiction stories um, by Isaac Asimov from the 1960s. So in Black Rock City this year, we'll see a whole range of projects related to artificial intelligence, technology, everything from encrypted data to blockchain. Uh, there'll be a whole range of things. And it was interesting, the proposals we got this year, we got a lot of robots, we got a lot of things with eyeballs. Um, we got a lot of robots with eyeballs. <laughs> so, but one of the things I love about the theme is this um, 
these layers of meaning that you can find within that theme. So yeah, you can have a robot with eyeballs, or you can find something deeper in that level of arti artificial intelligence. So within all of this sort of robotic stuff, I want to remind you that, that this whole um, practice and experience is very human-based that you'll see uh, maybe one or two artists from each project presenting here, but know that there's a whole team, a whole collective, a whole community behind each one that makes it happen. And so out of these, you know, as you know, last year over 300 pieces uh, showed up and we expect something in that range again this year. You know, we don't ask anybody to come, right? This is everybody saying, hey, I, I've got an idea. I want to bring this. I want to share with a fellow artist, my fellow citizens in Black Rock City. And we don't actually know in advance because we don't ask for that, we don't commission art. Uh, that's just all of you deciding what you want to bring to share with everybody else. And so we encourage you that if you, what you see up here today, this is gonna be, there's only 15 projects out of those 300. And then imagine over the years, over the last 32 years, that we've got hundreds, uh, equaling thousands of people who've brought, and teams who've brought art to the desert to share. That can be any one of you. There's no barrier to entry for anyone other than your own desire to bring it. So please do. We'd love to have you.